welcome to DuCoin, Illinois. We invite you to enjoy this video of our city as we introduce you to the people who are DuCoin. You will discover the many benefits and amenities DuCoin has to offer through a series of videos featuring the services and infrastructure of our city, our education and healthcare systems, protective services, recreational opportunities, and so much more. Now, let's meet the people who are DuCoin. DuCoin is just a good place to live. People here are, are giving, uh, they're generous, uh, they try to help one another. We've got some great hospitals and I think that's the main thing that attracts people to small towns is when you have good hospitals and you have good school districts. We're very fortunate that we've got both of those. The role of the urgent care here in DuCoin as well as with the hospital and the emergency services and the specialty services as well as primary care, it's very vital to the community. It keeps people here in town, makes the community vibrant. We have great schools. We have great health care facilities. Uh, we have a viable downtown uh, with businesses, restaurants, and an attractive landscape. Over the last several years, we've, you know, we've used TIF funding to lay new sidewalks on Main Street. Uh, we've got uh, new trees on Main Street. Uh, we've keyed off Main Street for our holiday lights. The bank, local bank and Duke Coins come forward and donated a community Christmas tree that we hadn't had in over 60 years. We happen to add a nativity scene for our Main Street. We're kind of known as the Hallmark card of Southern Illinois when it comes to the holidays. The downtown area has been entirely renovated. It's a traditional downtown that resembles a Norman Rockwell painting. When you come into town and you drive down Main Street and you see how beautiful it is, who wouldn't want to be in this community? We have a great uh, retail shopping area in our community. Uh, we offer Amtrak service to other parts of the state. Uh, our first responders are some of the, the best people with our police, our fire, our emergency service providers. We have the second state fair that, that takes place in our fairgrounds. Our fairgrounds offers a lot of great opportunity for other events throughout the year, for recreational opportunities. We have highly active service organizations uh, that want to be involved in the community. Uh, we also have great churches, churches that want to extend faith opportunities to everyone. We've got a nice little community where I think everyone bands together and tries to get things done. Dewcoin is a nice change of pace um, for the fact it's much more affordable, taxes are stable, it's a quiet, safe and secure place to raise a family. What I like about Dewcoin is that it's a small town. You know just about everybody that you see. You go into different uh, places in town and you can have a good conversation with somebody. Everybody knows everybody. It's a good community where people help each other out. You find that out during storms and times of trouble when the people come together. Anytime that uh, a bad thing happens to anybody in this town, this town picks up. They don't ask questions. They don't ask how we can help. They just roll up their shirt sleeves and they start helping. And I love that. New coin, there's, there's no other place like it. I mean, when I was a kid, yeah, I had dreams of traveling, but as I got older, I really saw what was important in life and the genuine people and their hearts and, and the way that they treat others. That's where I want to be. I want to be in DuCoin. I think that my favorite thing about DuCoin overall is its stability, its traditions. It is a traditional community with traditional values. At the same time, it is willing to move with the times. And because of the state fair, it's uniquely situated to be a great host. Love uh, living in a small town. Love it, love living in DuCoin in particular. They're just a wonderful group of folks here. Really have a sense of community. And you know, whether you're at uh, Kai's Park for a a concert or at uh, Van Meter Field on a Friday night. There's a, just a great sense of community here and it's a close-knit group. But it's again very welcoming to people who aren't from DuCoin. First off, I think just how welcoming the people here are in DuCoin I think is, is one thing that uh, as an outsider, you know, coming to town, even um, experience bringing some of my old teammates up here and they've always, the first thing they've always said is just how welcoming everybody is and how nice everybody is and we have a lot to offer. It's a town that has everything anybody would need. There's enough stores, there's enough restaurants, and there's enough camaraderie with 
school district with um, neighbors, with my family members, and I've never wanted to leave home, and this is where I've always wanted to stay. I said I was born and raised in DuCoin. Uh, it's a great town, great people. Um, love the DuCoin Indians. I love this community. I was born and raised here. I can't imagine being anywhere else. Growing up here and being a part of um, athletics and being a cheerleader and going to ball games, I mean, I love it here. It's right in the middle of southern Illinois. Or we have moderate weather, you know, if you want to get that, uh, that deep. But uh, I think it's, um, it's just a good place to live, raise a family. It's a comfortable place and it's, you don't have uh, much fuss or fuss and uh, mind your own business. And for the most part, people uh, treat you the same way you, you treat them. We're always looking for uh, new businesses to start up. And, you know, we're always looking for, for good people to move to our town. We are new coin.